delivers the pass to the monster. Just five to shoot. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. That one, no good. Inside, here's White. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Yeah, good awareness there. He sees an opening and doesn't hesitate. And that's not the type of defense you want to play, right? You've got to make it more difficult than that. Layups are too easy. Baller passes to the monster. Here's Clutch. He's guarded by Williams. Passes to D. He kicks to Murphy. Here's the monster. Nice D from Brooks. Boy, that's high-impact defense in the lane. Standing tall to deny the easy bucket. Gone 0 of 4, missing their first four field goals here. Pass to D. Just about two minutes into the game, first quarter of basketball. Baller passes to the monster. This one for three. That doesn't go, and he's 0 of 1 from the field. Yeah, slow start right now. Five straight misses to get this one going. Now the pass to Clutch. Outside Williams. Here's Clutch. Little passes to Clutch. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. I mean, even he was surprised to be that open. They could use a big right, shot right, here right, to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Started. Right now, they need a basket. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Well, I had a chance to talk with head coach David Fisdale. Going into the first game of the season, he said we have to attack them inside and in transition. See how that works out. If they don't adjust, we're going to keep pressing it. Well, Kevin, that seems like a good idea considering his explosive team that he has. Back to you. Thank you, David. Baller passes to D. Here's Clutch. White covering on the mark with the 15-footer. And here in the first, uh, about three minutes in, passes it to Clutch. And here is Williams, out left to the wing. Here's Brooks. That shot off. Yeah, affecting the shot in a big way there. Excellent defense. Well, you talk about getting into the space of the shooter. This is how you defend the paint. Gone three of seven from the field since we've gotten underway. Williams passes to Little. Back to Williams. Here's Clutch. He's guarded by Murphy. A putback. Great positioning on the putback. Clutch has got his second bucket of the game to go. I tell you, they better work out harder on the defensive end to box him out. He's going to live on those second chances. Pass the ball. Here's the monster. Clutch the pass to Murphy. Out to the wing. To the inside. That one wide left. Well, the defense trying to get out on him, but he's left with the open shot. He's got to make that one. Plenty of daylight on that shot. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. The pass to Baller. Kicks to Murphy. Here's Clutch. Passes it to Deep. Now, here is Murphy. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. D. Another shot. And the basket by Murphy. I tell you, good things always come when you've got players who work hard for second chance opportunities. Outside, White. Williams finds Brooks. White with it. Little passes to Brooks. On the wing, Williams. He tries for three. That one misses. He doesn't hit that one. 
gone just a shade under 50% from the field. Five of 11. Here's Clutch. He's guarded by Murphy. Pass to Little. And it's Brooks at the elbow. And the pass to Little. Here's Clutch. He's coming off a 13-point game against Indiana. I thought his physicality was crucial, too. You know, he kept the defense on their toes and repeatedly got to the free throw line. It's deflected. Bring it around 42% since the opening tip. Pass to Little. Now here's Williams. Pass to Brooks from 18 feet away. And the shot no good, a bit short. Well, yeah, I mean, you want to give your offense a chance, and that possession didn't do it. Not, not at all, Greg. I mean, no reason for him to be taking these kinds of shots. He has only himself to blame. The feed to White. It's good. Great play by Williams to set it up. Williams has got three assists tonight. And so the timeout by David Fisdale here. Yeah, and for two squads that don't know each other all that well, this should be an intriguing battle. Right. In a matchup where you don't see the opponent often, there should be a lot of surprises. I don't know what to expect. And the home team has possession. Trailing here by eight. You know, they worked hard. They drew fouls, but they just couldn't convert at the line. I think that's the most frustrating thing, right? You've earned the opportunity to take those free throws, and you don't cash in at the line. Jay, the pass to the monster. Can't connect from 13 feet out. Well, it's been an up-and-down quarter for him on the offensive end. Mostly down, though. That pushes it to double digits. Six points for Clutch. Clutch has gone three of six from the floor. Pass to Speedy. Here's Magician. He gives a bit of a scoring lift to the team, averaging eight points a game. Jay, the pass to the monster. To the left wing. To the left side wing. Unloads. From the top of the key, he buries it. The monster's got his second basket of the night. Gone 7 of 15 from the field at this point. Johnson kicks to Robinson. Here's prime time. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. To the left side wing. Here's Huffman. That's no good. Couldn't get his first shot to go. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Here's the pass to Jay. For three. Robinson pulls it in. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Passes to Big Dog. Outside Robinson. Pass to Clutch. Let's it go from 14. That miss is his fourth this game. He's shooting three for seven from the field. The pass to Speedy. Here's Magician. Lands soft on the front of the rim and drops. 121 left in the first. Outside Robinson. Passes it to Big Dog. Lets it fly. Fires the jumper from the corner and nails it. But you know what? Sometimes something good can come out of a bad possession in the early going here. Pretty dreadful. 22%. Pass to Jay. There's the pass to Magician. Here's Jay. To the left side wing. Passes it to Magician. Here's Speedy from the arc. Trains the three-pointer. Guys, listen, the defense was totally invisible on that three-point attempt. Nobody even in his zip code. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Pass to Robinson. Pass to Big Dog. Back to Robinson. 
the pass to Big Dog from 20 feet out. No good there. And it's good, but hold on. The officials may want to look at that one on the replay monitor. And indeed, they're going to look at it again. They need to be certain he beat the buzzer. And, and they're, they're making sure on this one, even though it may not matter in the grand scheme, but the replay process is faster than ever. You know, why not? And it looks like they got it right this time. No basket. The clock had expired while the ball was still in his hand. And even if they don't show it, I know the refs are proud of themselves after a replay proves them right. They're like, see, we had it right all along. So good call, fella. And we reached the end of the first quarter. The away team up by five. And we'll be back with you for the start of the second quarter when we return. And if you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter in this one. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the visiting team, what do you think? I think they play great D and, and not giving up anything easy early on. You love that they're making the offense work, right? Making every single thing they try to do hard. They've got the magician. Also the monster out there. And it's night and at the small forward spot. Passes it to magician. Down low. Knight against Johnson. Shot on the wing. A shot by Knight, no good. Being about 42% so far. They've got prime time. Johnson is out there with Insanity. Then it's Robinson, and it's Big Dog, and at the pivot spot, Manning the middle. And he banks in the layup. Prime time's got his first two points of the night. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Kevin, the league has unveiled a five-point plan to improve player-referee relations. Things became heated last season with a lot of star players ejected for arguing with officials. The emphasis on respect and clear standards of conduct on both sides can only help. Kevin? Very good point, David. Completely agree. Thanks. Outside Robinson. Woods the pass to Black. Here's prime time. Outside Robinson. That three off the mark. 23% from the field. That's not going to get it done. Knight passes to the monster. And it's blocked. And that goes out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. Knight wide open from outside off the mark. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Kicks to Robinson on the wing, Johnson. On the wing, Johnson. Shot clock at six. Pass to Woods. Deep two from Robinson. Can't nail the jump. Gone 0 of 4 in the second quarter. Obviously, that needs to change. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Timely passing leads to assists, and that's been the recipe for success. Pass to Johnson. He kicks to Robinson. And the shot is long. Gotten off to a rough start here in the second quarter, going just one for five. Here's the pass to Magician. Here's Clutch. Passes it to Speedy. Knight in the corner. Pass to the Monster. The layup off target. 
Well, defenders are in the area, and that's all it took to force him to change his release. Still unable to connect this quarter, really looks frustrated. Just needs to try and stay calm. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. Johnson against Knight. The pass to Clutch. There's Speedy. No good from outside. Got the defender off his feet with the pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. Outside, Robinson. You know, Doris, certain guards just have a knack for scoring in the post. Uh, when you think of that list, I'm sure there are a couple right at the top that come to mind. Yeah, well, who, who don't you want to deal with in the low post out of the guard position? I'll give you one. Dwayne Wade. If he's oh, yeah. on the post with a back down dribble that he can use to his advantage, turn the lights out. Here's another guy. Sean Livingston. Unbelievable length. Plays at his own pace. Both guys are nightmares in the post. Good luck checking either one. UK leaderboard to look at the teams that specialize in intimidation. And sometimes a team will get one guy who can block. Other times a guy finds ways to get others involved in blocking. It, it can be contagious. If he can do it, wh why not me? Then all of a sudden you look up and you're leading the league in block. Little knocks down the three ball. Waller's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. And 23% from the field. That's not going to get it done. D, he's guarded by Williams. Here's Clutch. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. And that was a, a real quick comeback there. Both sides showing some range. But both teams are pulling the trigger right now, showing great confidence from behind that arc. Williams kicks to White. Brooks, the pass to Black. And here is Brooks. Outside, White. A three ball. Brooks misses. And, and got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Passes to Clutch. He feeds it to Murphy over Brooks. Murphy can't hit. Gone just two of eight shooting here in the second quarter. Outside Williams, pass to Little, dishes it to White. Williams for three, offensive rebound, trying to get open is Brooks. A nice shot by Black. Oh my goodness, that is how to attack the rim. Don't give the defense time to react, that's beautiful. The pass to Ball. Here's Clutch. Here's D. Off target with his three is definitely lagging at the moment. They're just 30% in the second quarter. White dishes to Black. Williams kicks to Brooks. Outside, White. Brooks, outside. Outside, White. Little passes to Brooks. Over Murphy. He makes that one drop only a second and five tries. <laughs>
passes it to Clutch. Pass to Bolt. Here's Clutch. The pass to Magician. Six on the shot clock. From deep three-point range. And the foul goes on the Magician. That is his first foul of the game. Jays checked in for the Magician. Clutch has gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. Passes to Little. Now here's Williams. Pass to Little. Feeds it to Brooks. With the second effort, Brooks. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And, and I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. With the analysis, the defensive impact becoming more advanced, Doris, do you think that helps defenders gain recognition even when they're not uh, putting up numbers in individual statistical categories. Well, think about a recent winner of the Defensive Player of the Year, and that's Draymond Green, whose value becomes into sharp focus, particularly in the fourth quarter of games. When it becomes a possession ball game, and Draymond Green is flying around the floor in help defensive position, covering up for teammates' mistakes, I absolutely think, Kevin, increasingly because of the advanced metrics, that players can be defined outside of points and rebounds. So I love the impact of the numbers. Jay, the pass to ball. And he lays it straight in. Baller's got his first points of the night. I tell you, coaches love those high percentage looks in the paint. And there's the pass to Little. Kicks to Brooks. Shoots from 14. No good. Shot missing. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. D. He's guarded by Williams. Passes it to Ball. Here's Clutch. Pass to Ball. Here's Murphy. Offline from the top of the key. Being about 35% from the floor. Not much falling for them. We've got 123 left in the first half. Outside White. The pass to Clutch. Fades away. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Clutch has got nine. You know, being that wide open sometimes leads to a miss, but that fadeaway was money. Now the feed to Murphy. To the wing on the left. Knocked loose. Pass to Jay. Off target from three-point range. Just enough coverage to bother that three-point attempt. Here's Williams, and they pick up two. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Guys, they're looking for a spark here. out there with clutch then there's the monster then there's baller and it's murphy in at the four spot and that's the group for david fisdale as we begin the second half has to little he kicks it to williams off target from outside being a rough 22 percent so far in this one Here's Clutch, white covering. Here's Murphy. That's tipped. Here's Clutch. Add another make to his scoring column. His fifth basket of the game. Now shooting 5 of 11. They are just killing him on the interior. D. He's guarded by Williams. Now the pass to Clutch.
Pass to Murphy. To the left side wing. Clutch. And the baseline jumper, no good. Well, an 0 for 3 start to the second half. They're going to have to start tightening things up on the offensive end. We've gone 0 of 3 and are still looking for that first bucket here in the second half. Over to the left wing. Lays it up off the glass. Give credit where credit is due right there. A terrific assist. And White kicks to Williams. Passes to Little. Brooks outside. Little passes to Williams. That misses off the backboard. I don't like their energy level since the break, right? They've missed three of their first four shots. Shoots. Brooks grabs the board. Brooks has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. Pass to ball. Here's the monster. Here's Clutch. Brooks covering. Here's Clutch. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single-digit lead. Clutch has got six points. Gotten just one of their first four shots to fall since coming out of the locker room at the break. Williams passes to Clutch. Kicks it to White. And the pass to Williams. And he drops it in from the low post. He's got six. I love this approach. Despite the lead, still attacking, adding fuel to the fire. They are absolutely relentless right now, Greg. There's no end in sight. They are going for it. D, he's guarded by Williams. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Murphy from 15 feet away. Brooks grabs the board. Brooks has got rebound number 13 with that last one. Passes it to D. A three-pointer off the mark. Just can't find a shot. It's no wonder they're losing. I mean, he's been completely scoreless all night. And Brooks gets it to go. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. And so the timeout by David Fisdale here. Yeah, I think Coach calls his timeout right now because he's not happy with the distribution of shots. Difficult shots, contested shots, you've got to get a better offensive rhythm. Both teams deciding to change it up. Gone just 25% from the field here in the second half. They're two of eight. Pass to D. That's good. The assist that time from Knight. D's got his first basket. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Williams against Knight, and there's the pass to Little. Offside Williams. Fires at the elbow. Off the left rim and out. Gone a lackluster three of nine from the field since halftime. Side night. Puts up a three. They get the rebound. The monster. And they call the foul. So a chance at the line for one more coming up. Yeah, outstanding job there of taking the harm and still able to finish. And he's got his first chance at the line here. One thing we've seen from these guys is excellent passing. No doubt about it. It's fun to watch the way they're operating as a team right now. They are all in sync. Big dog, the pass to Little. Six on the shot clock. Passes it to Big Dog. Here's prime time from 18 feet away. And the shot goes in. Nice pass there to set that basket up. Just 33% in the second half so far. They need to look at more high quality shots. Knight taking his time here. No good on that one. Well, yeah, I mean, you want to give your offense a chance, and that possession didn't do it. Not, not at all, Greg. I mean, no reason for him to be taking these kinds of shots. He has only himself to blame. Pass to D. tonight launches it that shot off 
Gone an even 50% from the floor here in the third quarter. Four of eight. Clutch the pass to Woods. Drills the three-pointer. Primetime's got five points now in the quarter. Boy, they are not locked in defensively here in the second half. The intensity and focus haven't been there. Out to the wing. Magician passes to Ball. It's stolen. Kicks to Williams. Here's prime time. He has seven. Now the pass to Little. Just five on the clock. Over in the corner, Williams. Passes it to Woods. Over in the corner, Williams. And what was that about? Not a good shot right there. Just not there from a rhythm standpoint right now. It's really eluding him. Quick shot there, and it's off target. Well, you just wonder if maybe he should take it inside when they're playing so far off him. Pass to Big Dog. Puts it up from 17. That shot is off. And around 24%. Not a good showing here. The pass to Magician. They could use a bucket. Here's D. Plays it up and banks it in. And that's a great play on the backboard for him. I mean, it's what we expect. All his second chance points do not come by accident. Here's Big Dog. Looking at his numbers, he's averaging about uh, six and a half points a game. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now, you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Pass to D. Out tonight. Shoots a three, buries the long-range jumper. Knight's got five now. That's what you call working inside out, drawing the defense in close, kicking it out for the open jump shot, nice and easy. And hey guys, you know, you never run out of things that you can improve upon. I think, Greg, it's important to keep that hunger, right? You're always striving to get better and to change things up. And let's check out the numbers for Speedy. How last month turned out for him, he's averaging eight points, three rebounds, and two assists. And those numbers, solid, not spectacular, and, and sometimes what you see is what you get. There's no doubt. This is a guy who understands his role, knows he's got to give you quality minutes, and that's what they expect from him. Johnson surveying the floor. Here's prime time. He has seven. Robinson kicks to Black. Johnson for three. The shot, no good. Speedy the pass to D. Pass to the monster. Here's Speedy. Five on the clock to the paint. And he uses the glass on the layup. He has five. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Outside, Robinson. A pass to Big Dog. Johnson outside. There's Big Dog. Outside, Robinson. Passes it to Big Dog. Outside for Robinson. Let's the three fly. That shot missing. And he's clearly been the best rebounder on the floor today. Well, he just works so diligently inside, and the numbers back that up. There's 48 seconds left to play in the third. Here's prime time. Looking at his point production, he averages almost eight points a game. Johnson in the corner. Here's Huffman. That one falls coming off Johnson's feet. Johnson's got three assists now in this one. Yeah, the defense not closing out in time. He's too quick and too good to miss many of those. Pass to D. Here's Magician. Here's Speedy. He's got five. And the pass to D. Here's Magician. It's good from the top of the key. Magician's got his second bucket. 
Here's prime time. From 11 feet away. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And we've reached the end of the third. The away team, they're up by six. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. And now we have a moment to uh, reveal our State Farm assist of the game. It's just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? We call that Greg putting it right in the pocket. And he knew what to do with it once it was there. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. Being a lackluster, 38% for the game, struggling so far. Brooks is out there with Insanity. Then it's Robinson. Then it's White. And it's Johnson in at the small forward. Brooks finds Johnson. Now Brooks. Johnson inside. Blanketed by the D. He fights to the rim for the layup. Here's Clutch. Passes it to Speedy. Here's Magician. Pass to Jay. The dish to Murphy. Four on the shot clock. Got a piece of it. And he gets it back. I'll tell you, I hate to say it, but he's been dragging them down all night. The effort's there, but he continues to be ice cold. Robinson left side. That one's not going to go. I'll tell you, they've had to look elsewhere for their scoring, and they've gotten it. This guy has had very little impact on the game offensively. Now here's Johnson. He's covered closely. Outside Robinson. Johnson right side. He kicks it to Black. Johnson the pass to White. Robinson dishes to Brooks. And the rebound goes to Murphy. Gone 0-3 to start the fourth quarter. Offline with his three. Well, you, you see the struggles he's having getting anything to go. Yeah, I mean, he's obviously cold right now, but he's trying to find that rhythm. You've got to keep working. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. Here's Magician, and the layup's good off the glass. Yeah, the D has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the floor. Now White. Robinson kicks to Brooks. Outside, White to the middle. Deflects the pass. Murphy with the steal. Here's Speedy, guarded by Robinson. The pass to Speedy. Inside, looking to end his cold spell, and the basket by Murphy. Oh, nice screen. Really a poor defensive reaction, and the obvious result. You simply can't give him that. You have to fight through the screen and at least get a hand in the face of the shooter. Black kicks to Johnson. Right wing. Robinson passes to Black over Murphy. Black, no good. Gone just 33% from the field in the fourth quarter so far. They are two of six. Here's Clutch, White covering. Here's Magician. Tips it up. Tries yet again. A shot missing. Nice D from Brooks. Their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively. That one falls. Coming off the Johnson feet. Eight points for Brooks. Boy, nice team basketball being played right there. You see the open man and you deliver the ball right away. Passes it to Jay. Pass to Speedy. Over to the wing. To the wing right side. Clutch the pass to Magician. From about 16. And it's White with the rebound. 
you know, they're trying to battle back, but he's missing shots this period. Here's Robinson, and he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. for Robinson. Both teams will make substitutions. That one is no good. Doris, what is your solution to the controversy surrounding one and done? Kevin, I believe the one and dones will be a thing of the past, and I think it will happen shortly. And the reason that can now become a viable option is the G League holds the key. You can now allow players to enter into the minor league straight out of high school. If they raise the salary of those G League players, then it helps across the board. Got a hand on it. Here's Speedy, guarded by Robinson. Speedy, the pass to Murphy. Robinson pulls it in. Robinson's got his fourth rebound in this one. No question he's having a bad quarter, so somebody else needs to take charge of the scoring if they're going to cut into this deficit. Goes back up. That shot, no good. A ghastly 26% from the field. Their offensive game looking completely out of whack. Clutch the best to the monster. Here's Speedy. Brooks covering. Pass to Murphy. Here's Clutch. Murphy with the ball. And the pass to Clutch. Three pointer on the way. No good that time. And just 30% from the field here in the fourth. Pass to Robinson. Outside, White. To the middle. Brooks kicks to White. Outside, Robinson. From deep three-point range. And it's White missing. Three on three. Passes it to Clutch. To end the drought. And right on target. Good. And if you're sensing a concern, best thing you can do is call timeout. Yeah, I don't think there's any doubt. You've got to get this game under control. I think he sees some adjustments he can make. Presentation of our Jordan player of the game, B. And the D tried to get physical with him down low tonight, and, and it really backfired. Uh, instead, he's just torn them up. He was aggressive, inviting the contact, and really just taking it straight to him. Well, he needed a game like this badly. He's been struggling for a while now, but tonight he broke out of that slump in style. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Hey guys, well during the break I was able to catch the message the visiting team coach gave to his team. He told them, put your foot on their neck, take it to them. I want to see you guys slow it down out there, use the clock, and stay away from silly fouls. Let's see if they can execute the plan, guys. 
The pass to Little. And here's White. Releases from 15. Here's Brooks. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. First free throw is good. And both free throws good for Brooks. Here's Clutch. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Pass to D. Here's Clutch. White covering. Passes to D. Just five on the clock. Baller passes to D. Sinks the triple. And he's showing signs now of life after going scoreless through the half. And there's the pass to Little. Brooks feeling it out a bit. Pass to Little. Kicks it to Williams. Right side, White. Here's Brooks. Can't connect from short range. Yeah, affecting the shot in a big way there. Excellent defense. Well, you talk about getting into the space of the shooter. This is how you defend the paint. Way to attack there and then create the contact. At the line. Perfect. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Plenty of drama in this one so far. Yeah, don't be surprised if it isn't decided until the final buzzer. Little passes to Clutch. No good there off the double clutch. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D. Allen's position, you could see the frustration on his face. Here's Clutch, white covering. Clutch the pass to Murphy. to ball. It's up a three. And no good that time. And that shot isn't the one they should be taking if they want to make this comeback happen. Pass to White. On the wing, Williams. Trying to break that ice cold streak. And the shot goes in. 13 points for Clutch. 149 left to play in the final quarter. D. He's guarded by Williams. D passes to Murphy. Lock at six. The pass to Clutch. Murphy on top. Out to the right wing. Ball. Brooks grabs the board. And poorly just 35% so far. Here's Clutch. Great look, but off the mark. Being only 27% from the field, looking pretty ugly out there. Here's Clutch. And then Murphy with the dunk. And gobbled up that rebound and went straight into attack mode on the putback. Oof, he, he is one of the most determined rebounders, guys, uh, we have got in the NBA. The tireless work ethic, the passion. He's a guy the team relies on for that. Williams can't hit. 
Martin an appalling 26% in the fourth quarter. Money! And he has brought them to within two points. Fearless, decisive, on point. Which is exactly what you have to be, especially when your team needs a bucket. And they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. No clue how he got that one to fall. A few more trips like that, and we might be able to see this one in the books. And so the timeout by David Fisdale here. Guys, what do you think? And they need to use as little time as possible here. If they can get a bucket before the clock hits 24 seconds, they can try for a stop on the next possession. If there's less than 24, then they'll have to foul. There's 37 seconds left in the fourth. D, he's guarded by Williams. Great job on the glass. Bodies down low, needing to fight for position. That's perfect. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Drops the first one, and that increases their lead to six. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's a seven-point game. Boy, those free throws add a nice cushion to their lead. And so the timeout by David Fisdale here. Seven seconds left to play here in the fourth. And since halftime, they have been locked and loaded from beyond. Yeah, there's no question about it. Knocking down triples repeatedly. The defense starting to look helpless at this point. No choice but to foul there, but, it, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. Two shots. He hits the first one, and that puts them up by five. And so he drops them both. It's a six-point ball game. 23 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. D, he's guarded by Williams. Has to clutch. Tries a three. Rebound by Williams. And that's an intentional foul. Two 
So the first one drops, and that makes it a seven-point lead. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's an eight-point game. Passes to Jay. Leases one from three. And every set they're running looks like it's designed to produce a triple. Well, you love how the ball is popping outside on the perimeter. It's being moved and finding the open man, and they're cashing in. The visiting club takes the win on the road. A truly gutsy performance away from home. You know, it, it really was. And, Kevin, when this one was hanging in the balance late, they showed just what a tough-minded group they can be. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Doris Burke, David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew,